Hey guys, welcome back. If you're not running a fast PC, you may get some slowdown in God of War 2 and Battlesera. In today's video, we'll show you how to speed things up, get a USB keyboard handy, and welcome to Team Pandori. Anyway, let's get into it. In Battlesera, if we long press on a game, we can actually get advanced game options. And from here, we can usually set game resolution and things like that. The skip draw hack works as frame skip, but for God of War 2, we'll need to get to the PCSX2 option screen. The easiest way to find this is to push F1 on the Battlesera system selection menu, then go to Applications. In here we've got the PCSX2 config, click that and away you go. But in today's video, we're going to do it all on the fly, so we can instantly see how our options affect the game. So in Battlesera, let's load up God of War 2. And as you can see, it slows to a crawl. So now let's plug in the keyboard and then push Alt and Enter. From here, press Alt and Tab a couple of times until we get a little box at the corner. From here, we need to pause it, so we can either press Escape, or we can press Alt and S. You can see we're at the menu at the top, so push down once and then Enter. Now the game's paused, let's change the options. Press Alt and Tab, so the box at the top left is selected. And then press Alt and C. You can see that's opened up the configuration menu, and with General Settings selected, push Enter. Now that we're in the General Settings, push Tab once, and then Space. Make sure Enable Speed Hacks is checked. Now to get around the menu, we need to use Tab. Push it twice. Now we can go to the first slider. This is the clock speed of the PlayStation 2. Let's overclock it slightly. Push Tab to go to the next menu, then slide this up. This is kind of like frame skip. Other values can be changed by pressing Tab, highlighting them, and then pressing Spacebar. So let's navigate to OK, then press Space. To test these settings, we're going to unpause it. So in the Alt Tab, get to the top left window, push Alt and S, then go to Resume. Now we need to get back to the main window, Alt Tab, and then let go. We can go full screen with Alt and Enter, and let's test. Playable, but not very smooth. Let's try some other options. The mini PC we're using to test this likes the settings here. We're taking advantage of underclocking the emulated PS2. Let's look into the other menu. So press Alt and C, then go down to Graphic Settings. And from here, we'll try and free some more resources. If you've got a fast PC, you can always bump the resolution up, but we're going to keep it at native. We're going to change MIP mapping to off. And the last option, blending accuracy. Let's change this to minimum. Now tap through the options, get to OK, and press space. And now we can play. If you found this video helpful, please hit the like, subscribe, and bell. This has been Amy Chicken of Team Pandory, and I'll see you on the next one. Ta-ra.